to eat. and I wish you all the best. I am Mrs. Chamatam. I'm going to be taking you English language. And the topic is pronoun. Can you repeat after me? Pronoun. Okay, I want you to listen attentively because after this class, you are going to define pronoun. You mention some examples of pronoun and you underline pronoun in the sentences. But before then, we are all familiar with the topic noun. What is a noun? A noun is a name of a person, animal, place, or thing. John is a name of person. Dog is a name of animal. Sokoto is a name of place, and table is a thing. So all these affirmations can be replaced by pronoun. What then is pronoun? Hello? Pronouns are words used instead of nouns. Pronouns are words used instead of nouns. Now, let's look at examples of pronoun. Number one, we have he. Can you repeat after me? He, she, she, he, he, we, we. I hope you are following. They, they, I, I, you, you, me, me, him, him, and her, her. Okay. Now, let's look at the uses of the examples we have mentioned. We have he. He is used for a boy or a man. He is used for a boy or a man. Then we have she. She. She is used for a girl or a woman. She is used for a girl or a woman. Then we have it. It is used for animals or objects. It is used for animals and objects. Okay, okay. Let's take the examples together or the activities. Number one, we have John is a boy. John is a boy. So what are we going to use to replace John? Very good, it's he. He, because he is used for a boy and a man. Number two, Fatima is a girl. Fatima is a girl. What are we using Fatima to replace? She. Very good. She is a girl. She is a girl. Number three. The 
dog has four legs. The dog has four legs. What are we replacing dog with? E. Very good. I and T. E. Then let's go to number four. Number four is the cup is on the table. The cup is on the table. What are we replacing cup with? Remember, cup is an object, right? And we use it for animals and objects. Good, it's E. E is on the table. It is on the table. We have come to the end of today's class. But before I go, we have activity to do. You copy and underline pronouns in the sentences. We have number one to five. Make sure that you do it. Remember, auntie loves you. Stay safe at all. Bye.